This is the intro, bitch. So just watch my shit. So this is my obligatory yearly Q&A type of thing. I didn't do one back at Christmas because I was too fucking lazy, but this is the Florida Q&A. So these questions are compiled of questions that people in real life have asked me and questions that have gotten on Twitter, Facebook, other uh, YouTube videos. Like multiple questions is compiled and a list of questions for me to answer to you, yeah fuckers. This question comes from my mother, and she asks, Jeff, why won't you get a pet? The reason I won't get a pet is because I once had a pet. It was a turtle named Raffaella, and I had her since the time I was eight to about seven-ish months after I moved into this place, which was 2013, and when she died, I was really fucking sad. This part of the video is for people who don't know me, so, it yeah. I had a kiddie pool for Raffaella. I put three rocks in the middle of the kiddie pool and she would swim around and have fun. She had one rock. She had one rock that she loved and it was this guy. She loved this rock. I'm pretty sure if I let it fall back right now, I would smash my teeth in. And they'd be a lot more fucked up than they already are. But she loved this rock and when she died, she was floating right here, right there on that rock. And it was it was really sad. I felt like shit for a couple days. Moving on from that topic that was really sad, we have another question that came off of Twitter, and it reads, Jeff, what kind of camera do you use? Okay, that one's really weird, because I've used three cameras in the full Florcurta ing thing. Yeah, that makes sense. So the first camera I used, actually no, four cameras, sorry. So the first camera I used was from my iPhone 4. Four. I think it was a four. And I, I just placed it right in front of my monitor on my computer and that's that's how I did it. That is what the uh, Godzilla review is filmed on was an iPhone. Then the other camera I've been I used for a very long time came from from my friend who's not my friend anymore, Kiko. He was the Asian guy that you've seen in some of my earlier videos. He gave me this. Now I am trying to sell this thing now because I don't use it anymore. But if I I am appreciative of Kiko letting me use this thing. But if you go back and watch some of my older videos, this thing really is a piece of shit. And then back in June, I got a Canon Rebel. Now the reason I'm not using it now is because I am trying to f like fix the, the lighting and the focusing on it is really odd and wonky. So I'm trying to make sure to get it right so whenever I make a video, it's all crystal clear. And you can see all of this and all its glory. And right now, I'm using my cell phone, which is an iPhone 6S Plus. That is a damn big phone. And like when I get the Canon right, with my iPhone 6S Plus, you can see all of this and all its glory. Fuck you. Another question comes off of like a Facebook comment, and this is a question that I've gotten from my brother. I think my sister asked it once or twice. I've gotten it from my mother on multiple occasions. I've gotten it from my dad, among a couple other people in life, and on Facebook and YouTube as well. They say, why don't you like the Fast and Furious movies? There's a difference between not liking the movies and not liking some of the movies. It's like how I say I love Star Wars, but I'm not exactly a fan of all the prequels. I like the Fast and Furious movies. Example, I stole this last year, fair and square. Look, Furious 7 is in there. I have Furious 7, and yes, I, I actually bought Furious 7. The other six in here, I, I stole this thing, but that's neither here nor there. And the last question that I've gotten multiple times on multiple sources, even from random people on Facebook, random people on Twitter, random people on YouTube, people have asked me, why do I do Florida TV? Here's a simple answer. It's a hobby. Here's the longer answer. I like doing it. That's really it. This is this is honestly a hobby. It's the reason I don't have a actual schedule of uploads. The only thing that I upload regularly is Jim John, and that's because I film multiple episodes at a time. Like I think we film I think like three or four episodes bi weekly. So every other week Austin comes over here and we film them. 
I have multiple Jim Johns ready to go, or multiple Jim John ideas ready to go. Actually, let's make this simple. Now those dates may change, those dates may not change, subjects are always changing dates, but yeah, that that's really it. I have a lot of them ready. All we gotta do is film them. But am I doing for the creative TV for money? No, no I'm not, I, I'm doing it for fun. If I get money, will I be okay with that? Oh, fuck yeah. But then people are going to be asked, Well, Jeff, what about your shit with Jeremy Johns? Okay. Okay. I'll answer that for you. I did it on a dare. I was on Twitter drinking with my friends, uh, like in real life, now on Twitter in virtual life. And then my buddy was like, Oh, hey, dude, you should totally tweet him. So one day I tweeted him and I was like, Hey, Jeremy, you want to do, do a collaboration? And that is how it happened. Yep. Now you know, Jeremy. Am I wanting to do more collaborations in the future? Fuck yeah, that'd be cool. But I I'm honestly doing it for a hobby. But who would I want to do collaborations with? The Flick Pick would be cool. That'd be awesome if I could do a do one with the Flick Pick. That'd be that'd be pretty sweet. John Flickinger, calling you out, man. But that's all the questions you guys have for me today, and I'll do another one of these in a couple months, probably. Everybody on YouTube, you know what I update regularly? Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go on there, type in for Lurkrata TV, boom, you got me. What should I review next? Game, movie, or show? Let me know in the comments below. Y'all got floored.